Any European Navy warship is going to have to face increasingly complicated threats in the waters they patrol, including threats from ballistic missiles. We're here at DSEI 2023 in London and have just toured the Royal Netherlands Navy ship De Reuter. It's an air defense and command frigate, and they've just gone through their midlife upgrade and received a brand new radar that's ready for today's threats and those that may come in the future. The De Reuter received the Talus Smart L radar during its midlife upgrade. This new radar is much more sophisticated and can find not only ballistic missiles that may be incoming to the ship, um, it's actually being experimented with to look at entirely new mission sets, including seeking out uh, satellites in space, as well as being eyed for future um, operations against hypersonic weapons. The idea for this particular frigate in the Navy is that the advanced TALUS radar would be able to find ballistic missiles that may be incoming to the area, and then the ship would be able to pass that m missile tracking to either another Netherlands ship, an American ship, any other allied ship in the region who is larger and better able to prosecute that threat. The De Reuter is just out of its midlife upgrade and going through a series of testing and trials right now. While most of those are aimed at getting the ship ready for its next deployment, they are also participating in a trial of the Tomahawk missile. The Netherlands Navy purchased a vertical launching system previously, but they did not have the Tomahawk missile just yet. Starting next year, in the fall of 2024, this particular ship will do the first ever launch of the Tomahawk missile from a Netherlands Navy ship. Uh, they won't be able to deploy with it just yet. This will be the first technical shot, and there'll be several more years of testing um, and making sure that they have all the safety and all the connections just right before the Navy will be able to deploy with this missile. But fall of 2021 off the coast of San Diego will be the very first step in outfitting the Navy with this particular weapon system.